hello and welcome back to so as you can tell from the title of this video i'm going to tell a story of how i got my job and how you too can be proactive and get yours it's very possible it's doable you can do it don't be scared don't be frightened don't think that the process is a process that is so tedious don't discourage yourself even before you start the journey have faith that what you're looking for you're definitely going to get it as long as you keep at it, you don't stop sending in those applications. Mind you, you have to send in as much applications as you can send. You never know which one will say yes. You are the one we have been waiting for. Hey kid, don't ever let them get inside your head. They'll tell you what to do in life instead. While I was still in school, like between six months to one year to my graduation, I already started looking for jobs because I know how tedious. It will be when you're done with school and the pressure you know that when you're done with school you only have one and a half year to look for a job here in germany if you cannot look for a job within this time you are expected to leave germany so i didn't want to get myself into that pressure so i started looking for a job even before i finished school so this is the secret when you look when you're looking for jobs don't just apply to jobs that um states all the characteristics you have even a job that does not have all the characteristics you have, even if the job have like half of the characteristics you, that you have, still go ahead and apply for that job. Here's what happened in my case. I sent applications to numerous places. I can't even keep count of how many places I applied to. Hmm. Hmm. I don't even want to think about it because uh, it was not easy. So I sent so many applications and I kept on getting, unfortunately, Unfortunately, we are sorry. We wish you all the best. You know, if you're in the job search process, you know. I know that it is very discouraging. Yeah, I know it makes you feel terrible, but don't give up. No matter how many rejections you get, it's okay. All you're looking for is just a one yes. So, no matter how many rejections I got, I kept on sending in applications until I sent it to this organization. And mind you, the role I applied for, the leader of it of the team for somebody who cannot speak good german yes i have the qualification but i cannot speak well i don't have working experience but i still went in and sent my application to work as a team leader can you imagine that was what gave me my job so i sent my application for that role and the girl they got back to me and said we saw that you applied for this role but we have another role that we think that you can qualify for are you interested for it and then they, they sent a link with this email that i can click and look at the job and if i'm interested i'm going to tell them that i'm interested in this role so that they're going to put me on the list of potential employees so when i got this email i was like yes it's finally working out so i told them yes i'm interested then um they short, they shortlisted me and invited me for an interview the following week. Then I traveled all the way and came for the interview. We did the interview, left, and I didn't hear from them until two weeks later. Then I got I got news from them that they, they gave me the job, that I that I qualify for the job, so I have it. I can they're going to send my contract to me. Once I get it, I can sign it and send it back to them and then go ahead and apply for my permit so you guys had it been i saw this role and i was like no i'm not sending my application for it because i don't think i fit to that position i wouldn't have gotten this job so why am i sharing my story i'm sharing my story to encourage you to let you know that it's not a problem it's not a bad idea for you to apply even to roles that you yourself, your conscience is telling you that, ah, Miss Evan, no say this role are not qualified for. But still go ahead and send in the application. What's the worst that can happen? They will say no. What's the best thing that can happen? They will shortlist you and give you an opportunity for an interview where you go there and sell yourself and convince them that you are the candidate for this job. This is my encouragement for you. This is my take back message for you. Don't be discouraged by the characteristics or the high profile that has been stated out in whatever job you are searching for. As long as you see that the role 
you are applying for and the characteristics stated there, stated there is a little bit aligned to what you can do if you know there is something that you can do whether you are fully qualified or not as long as you have some characteristics send in the application you never know you might be lucky just like i got my job by applying for it for for a bigger role and then i got a recommendation for a lesser role like a beginner role and i got it so this is what i did you too can do it i'm here today to tell you that it's possible so don't give up keep at it keep sending those applications you're definitely going to get that one yes you're been waiting for Thank you so much for watching i hope this video helps you if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel please do it to subscribe so that i don't miss out when i drop content like this see you in my next one bye